So I just invested in a 2.4 million shop lot. I know a lot of you guys have been asking me about property and real estate investment and how to choose a good investment. So I'm very excited to share with you guys my newest real estate investment. It is a 2.4 million ringgit shop lot, which is around 500,000 USD. The property I bought is located in a very popular district in Johor, Malaysia, which is where I'm located in. And later on in the video, I'm going to take you guys and show you guys the interior of the place I bought. And if you guys are interested in the math behind all the property investment I did and how much I'm earning, how much I'm paying for the installment, and how much I gain from this investment, do stay until the end of the video where I'll be going through the math with you guys. So before showing you guys the property, let me just explain to you guys why I choose this real estate investment and why I decided to buy that property for my investment. So I'm sure you guys know that the most important thing about real estate investment is location, location and location. So of course, I choose this place because of the location. The property is located in a very popular shopping and dining district where there's a lot of local and tourists that will go there and have a dine and have a dinner. And furthermore, there's a newly opened badminton court just right in front of my property. And there's also a big water park near it, meaning that there's always a bunch of potential customers going to my place. Overall, this location has a bunch of local and tourists every day. And by looking into the future of the place I've chosen, and I heard that there will be a hospital open nearby, and there's more potential for that area to further develop. And the price of the real estate that I invested in will definitely continue to grow. So that is one of the main reasons I chose to invest in that real estate. So let's go and take a look at the interior of my property. Okay guys, so this is the property that I bought. And right in front of my property, you can see that there's the big badminton court that I just mentioned that just newly opened. So I'm doing a voiceover over the original sound of this footage because there's a renovation happening nearby and there's a lot of sound on the background. So I'm doing a voiceover right now to actually cover up the noise and you can see that I'm blurring out a lot of things over the footage right now because in Malaysia agents will hang up their phone number and their pictures to really attract potential renters to rent our shop so I'm I'm trying my best to blur out the phone number so that their phone number would not be exposed online so yeah this is the property that I bought you can see that the space is very spacious it's very big and here is the water supply and there's the back door of the shop and this is the stairs leading up to the second floor which is also part of my property so here is the back alley leading to my property which is also the main alley that which is the main alley leading to the only exit of the back row of the shop which is also the main exit of the district which makes this a very good location for the shop and here's the back door of the shop and here's two complimentary toilet that they already supplied for us it's not quite clean yet because i just got the key or to the property and haven't got a chance to clean it yet and yeah it's quite big and spacious so you can do a lot of stuff with it and here's a little storage and there's a free dustbin and the power supply over there And you can see that the ceiling height is extremely high. I think it's around 3.5 meter high. So there's a lot of potential renovation you can do with this. And yeah, from here you can see that this is one of the main entrance and exit to this district. So my property is at the corner and one of the easiest spotting. And to me, this is one of the best location of this district. And now let's go up to the second floor and I'll show you guys around. Because the first floor is 3.5 meter high, so the stair is, is quite high as well. So yeah, here's the second floor and there's a lot of big windows over there and it's quite bright without any lights. And it's quite spacious as well and the window design to me is look great. Yeah, it's really quite spacious. But the ceiling is not as high as the first floor. And here's the water supply for the second floor. And here you can see the scenery from the second floor, which I know that there will be further development on that area as well. So the price of the property will further go up a lot in the future. And here's there also provided two toilets for the second floor. And yeah, everything is quite spacious and there's a lot of potential to really renovate and do a lot of stuff for this unit 
So let's get our way back to this small door in the second floor. So yeah, it's not quite big of an office or room for this second floor, but it got a nice view of the corner lot and I think it can be used to really make out a small office or a small private dining area. And here I'll let you guys see the scene from the second floor. And you can see that there's a lot of potential for further development and I know that this is a very good location because a lot of tourists and locals frequently come here to dine. So that's all from the interior of my unit. And here I'm going to show you guys some scene. The nighttime area here, there's a lot of cars, there's a lot of locals, there's a lot of shops over here. So to me, this location is a good investment because there's so much potential customer coming here and the place, the price of the place will definitely increase in the future. So now I'll be going through with you guys the math behind the price and how much I earn, how much I'm paying for the installment and stuff. So yeah, the total price of the unit is 2.4 million ringgit which is around 500,000 USD and the principal I pay is around 693,000 ringgit which is around 147,000 USD so the loan I got from the bank for this unit is around 1.7 million ringgit to pay back in 20 years which is around 360,000 USD so the monthly installment of this unit is around 9,535 ringgit which is around 2,035 USD including interest and the monthly rent that I can get from this place for the two floors is around 13,000 ringgit which is around 2,700 USD so the monthly return that I can get for this unit is around 3,465 ringgit and around 739 and 83 US dollar and there's two ways of me making money from this investment I did the first way is to pay back the loan slowly and take the monthly return as passive income which is the 3,465 ringgit. I can use this as my passive income because, because the rent of this place already pay back the installment and this is the extra return of my investment. So I can use this as a passive income for the next 20 years. Or the second part is I can use the monthly rent to fully pay back the loan which decrease the interest I need to pay back every month so that means that I don't need to use 20 years to really pay back the loan that I got from the bank maybe in 10 or 15 years I already fully pay back the loan I got from the bank and afterwards and after fully paying back the loan my passive income will become my monthly rent which is 13,000 and my passive income after paying back the loan will increase by a lot but this means that I won't be getting any passive income from this investment over the course of the loan so what I'll be doing is I'll be taking some part of monthly return and because I have a full-time job so I don't need that much money so most of the time I will just pay this 13,000 fully back to the loan which means that my interest and my year of paying back the loan will be faster so the main reason of me investing in this property is to gain passive income and this is how this unit can generate passive income in the future paying back the loan and is generating passive income for me this unit has already increased in value and the last time I checked for this value which is around 2 weeks ago the price of this unit has already increased to 2.6 million ringgit and as I pay back the loan and as years go by the price of this unit will further increase meaning that I'm not only earning from the passive income generated from rent I'm also earning from the price increase of this unit. And that is why I invested in this unit. And if you have any question regarding real estate investment, property investment, or investment in general, comment down below and I'll try my best to answer your question. And I'll soon make a video and share about another investment I did, which is an apartment. So do leave a like to this video and subscribe to my channel. This will really help support me. And I'll see you guys in the next one.